What's up guys? The plan for this morning is to go out, hopefully catch a couple trout that we can cook over a fire and make a little catch and cook video. Maybe if we're lucky we'll even find some morel mushrooms because it's definitely that time of year. That being said, the weather conditions are just terrible. It's super windy and rainy and it's really cold out there too. So I don't know how we're going to get a fire going. I don't know how well it's going to go, but we're definitely going to try and get some stuff to cook. We'll see how it goes. See if I don't sink in the mud here. Oh, there's a trout right there. Oh no. It's a bass. Yeah, I saw a trout over here though. Oh, this water's warm. This fish feels super warm. Obviously a very tiny bass. Not what we're looking for. Let's see if I can find that trout again. I think my fly is a bit too heavy for the situation right now, but I'm using a white streamer fly with some real heavy lead eyes. But most of the trout I've seen have been right on the surface, so I might have to change that up. Oh, I got one. Um, that's a rock bass. Didn't even know they had these in this pond. Rock bass on the fly. Interesting fish. Better than nothing. Not the trout we're looking for. comes. Dang. These fish are aggressive. I just can't get them to commit. You showing any interest? Oh my god! The one under me is like salmon size. Do you see that thing? Do you see him? That's the one right there. Oh perfect. Nice, finally. It's actually pretty clean, yeah, we'll eat him. Yeah. It's gonna be lunch. Finally. Way Jesus. to go. Now we gotta find some morel or morels. And yeah, no joke. All right, so here's our first fish that we're gonna eat. Looks kind of rough, but actually it's a pretty clean fish for Stockerfest. Hopefully we'll catch a couple more. For now, we're just gonna let him swim. Obviously these are stocked fish, so we don't really feel bad about keeping them. Should be tasty. So I'm hiding behind my car right now because it's so windy. We finally got our fish here. We spent way too long here in the wind and cold. Now we're gonna go to the river and try fishing for some more trout and hopefully finding some morel mushrooms also. Then we're gonna clean that fish and cook it up. Oh, there it is. All right, the shroom part went better than expected. We already found one and it's literally right off the path. So that's definitely gonna help us out, but we need a bunch more. In the car. Sick. I'm not gonna run all the way back to the car for this guy, but no, this'll help, I guess. <laughs> Dang, how'd you even see that thing? Oh, there's another one right here. Equally small. 
small gray. Oh, they're along this line. I have no idea how I found this one. There he is. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. That'll contribute something, I guess. All right, we're heading to the spot where we're gonna make a fire. We've got our fish, our shrooms, lemon juice. All right, so we got our fish here, which despite looking really weird on the outside, is actually really good looking orange meat. So I'm excited to try that. We got a couple mushrooms, the cooking supplies, well, we got to get a fire going first. That's a big challenge because it's been raining the past couple days and everything is pretty wet. So I'm going to go wash these mushrooms and then we'll get going on the fire. At least a temporary resemblance of fire. We'll get there. So he's going to do a fillet in the skillet. I'm going to take a fillet and wrap it in foil, and then we're going to do the shrooms on the skillet. That's the plan. I'm hoping that what will happen is it'll just glaze. Yeah. That's kind of the plan for this. Honey and oil. That'll be interesting. Honey, oil, get a lemon juice. Never had it before. It sounded like it might go all together, though. That could definitely be good. So I just got some butter in the foil. I'm going to take this fish, plop it down on there. Then I'm going to take some of these spices. This is garlic salt. I honestly don't know what the spice is, but I'm just going to throw it on there. Time. Time. Yeah, it probably that, is. Or partially. That makes sense. I'm just going to rub some of that in there. I'm just going to wrap that up. Consider it good to go. Oh my god, the mushrooms almost blew away. Okay. One trout filet, I'm gonna put it somewhere hot. This looks hot. Oh, it's oh hot. Guys. It's hot. God. Well, that's cooking already. Yeah, I don't mind where go. He's doing that. Yeah, that's going better than I thought. Wow. Must be really hot in there. That could be done. It's pretty tasty. Perfect. Throw that down. How much butter do you want? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I should use this. Oh, enough. All right, get that sizzling, and then we'll get the shrooms going. All right, you want to throw them on? Ready for them? Yep. Okay. I just got a whole hand. Is it sizzling? Uh, yeah. As soon as I put it on, it just starts going. Okay. Yay. There we go. Yeah. Well, those cook. I'm gonna pull mine out. It's got to be done by now. Got it. Please make it. This one's pretty good. Oh, this balance. Oh, shoot. So oh, we got it. We got oh, it. With a fire stick. We got it. Oh. I don't know. We made it. Yeah, that's good. That was pretty good to me. Yeah. That's cooked. And it looks pretty good. Oh yeah, flakes right off. For such an ugly fish, this meat looks pretty dang good. Double taste. It's pretty good. Already cooled off though. Oh yeah, mine's still hot. Mm. Flaky. Yeah, we forgot silverware. It's good, it tastes like trout you get from the store. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. I didn't even put lemon juice on this. Just mine butter. Mine could have used more honey. More honey? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that sounds good. Oh shoot, I have to try a shroom. Oh, 
I don't even know if the frame is on my face right now. But morel mushrooms are one of the best, one of the best foods nature provides. Just something about the flavor, mm -hmm. it's really good. There's a reason they're so expensive and people like to find them so much. The last piece. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this little catch and cook. I know we didn't really catch much, but the weather was honestly terrible. I didn't even think we were gonna get a fire. You were good with the fire though. We got a good fire going. Still going, kind of. I'm gonna was... go off your phone. All right, cool. It was definitely hot enough to cook. Those trout, even though they were so dang ugly, once you cleaned them, they actually taste really good. And the morels, obviously, morels are amazing. If you've never hunted for morel mushrooms before, you're kind of too late, but you should definitely go out and try it because it's super fun and they taste so dang good. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this style of video. I know you've seen a lot of videos here at Proud Lake, but we're gonna be trying new things and there will definitely be more catch and cooks in the future. So see you guys next time. Thank you.